Emotional and raw testimony, a Toronto Police Superintendent facing discipline apologized for helping constables cheat on a promotional exam. But as John Woodward reports, the hearing also delved into how unfair the hiring process was to black candidates to begin with and how a plan to fix it was cancelled without warning. The first part of Superintendent Stacy Clark's testimony was an apology for giving six constables questions in advance of a promotional exam. She told the hearing, it was tremendously important for me to take responsibility for what I had done. I know it was not the right path. But the tribunal spent much more time on what Clark called the why, and it came down to a systemic failure to promote black officers. They often uh, benefited uh, white men within the service. There was nepotism, there was favoritism. Um, and all types of other issues. It, it's common practice that senior officers have subordinate officers whom they mentor and therefore share interview questions with. The proposed solution that Clark supported and was adopted by Toronto's Police Service Board in 2021, a new procedure that involved providing the questions in advance to everyone. It was based on feedback from 500 Toronto police officers. The Toronto Police Service Board oversees the police, but the tribunal heard even though the board approved the plan, the police service didn't put it into practice. In a report, Professor Wendell Agite wrote before its implementation, the TPS made an executive decision without warning to suspend the new process and revert to the original unfair practice that the members identified in the external review. It stands to reason that had the TPS implemented the new promotional process, Superintendent Clark would not have felt the desperate need to flatten the playing field by providing black officers with the interview questions. It's not clear why the policy was never adopted. Somebody along the way decided that they weren't going to implement all of it. Supporters who arrived on a bus stood by Clark. I think instead of demoting her, they should uh, give her a award. Clark became emotional as she described demeaning posts from retired officers and one threat and how it affected her children. But she said she remained loyal to the TPS and hopeful for systemic change, saying, I love my job. I love what I do. Some may say foolishly, but I still believe we can do what we say we are going to do. The decision whether she'll have the rank to be in a position to help will be up to the tribunal. John Woodward, CTV News.